morning, Captains. I'm Alex Dorsey. And I'm Michael Croft. Thanks for tuning in for another episode of WK Today. Linker is sponsoring a giving tree for the families in need within our school. From this week until Tuesday, December 13th, a tree with tags of items families wish to receive will be set up in the tea and in the front lobby. If you would like to help one of the families in need, grab a tag off the tree that states an item that the family wishes to receive. The item does not need to be wrapped, but please bring the tag back with the gift. Please bring all gifts to room 208 or the front office by Friday, December 16th. Please note, a tree will also be set up during the holiday collage concerts for families to assist in taking tags to purchase gifts for families in need. Thank you to all who participate. Have a happy, happy holiday. The annual holiday collage concert begins tomorrow. Performances will be December, thir December Thursday, December 8th, Friday, December 9th, and Saturday, December 10th. Tickets can be purchased at waterfordpac.com. Before the th Thursday showing of the Holiday Collage, be sure to stop by the Empty Bowls Dinner in room 503 from 5.30 until 7.30. The dinner is hosted by the National Art Honor Society and will, be f and will feature soups and breads from all around town. There is a suggested donation of $2 per person, and you get to take it home a ceramic bowl. All money will be donated to the Lighthouse of Oakland County. In the spirit of giving this season, the canned food drive is back from now until December 15th. This is class competition and the class who brings in the most cans or non-perishable foods will receive $500. There are drop boxes in the AC. Now let's turn it over to Josh for sports. Thanks. In sports for today, the wrestling team travels to West Bloomfield for their competition at 5.30. The freshman and JV girls basketball teams won their games against Marion last night, while the varsity team lost to the number 12th ranked team by just three points in overtime. On the boys' side, the varsity team has, was crushed by Oxford with a score of 57-20. to 20. In NBA news, the Pistons held off the Bulls 102-91, to 91, putting the Pistons above the 500 mark on the season. In NFL news, the Lions continue on their winning streak, beating the Saints last Sunday 28-13. They currently sit alone in, the, in first place in the NFC North. In hockey news, the Wings beat the Jets in a shootout last night, winning with a score of 4-3. Although they are still last in the Atlantic Division, they have won their last two games. In college football, the playoffs are set. Number 1 Alabama will take on number 4 Washington, while number 2 Clemson will take on number 3 Ohio State. Number six, Michigan, will face number 11, For Florida State, in the Orange Bowl, while number 15, Western Michigan, will face number eight, Wisconsin, in the Cotton Bowl. That's all for sports. Now back to you guys at the news desk. Thanks. Come and join the Trading Card cl Games Club. Get involved in tournaments and gain card playing experience. If you'd like to get involved, please come by the Academic Center after school on Tuesdays and Thursdays during tutoring. Any current sophomores or juniors that are interested in attending OSTC next year as a new student need to turn in a request for consideration form to the counselor no later than December 15th. Request forms can be picked up in either the counseling office or the academic center. Please remember spots are limited, so apply today. Even though this is 2016, girls and women may still feel like they're playing. the playing field is even with their male counterparts in many fields. Let's take a look at this empowering PSA. They say because I'm a girl that I can't, that I can't be good at math, that I can't be good with technology, that I can't play football, I can't fight, that I can't be a fast runner, and that I don't have a voice to stand up for myself. As girls, we are made out to be seen as weak, that we don't have a voice in society, and that we can't make a difference in our community. We are seen as, as an object and not as a human being. Just because I'm a girl doesn't mean I can't, because I can. Instead of saying that you can't, say that you can. I can be good at math. I can be good with technology. I can play football with the boys. I can fight. I can be a fast runner. And I do have a voice. Every day, girls' self-esteem go down. As we are young, we think that we can be an astronaut or the strongest person in the world. But as we grow older, we are told no and no over again because we are girls. Don't let others crush your dream. Become that dream and show everyone that you can. Posso perché sono una donna. I can because I'm independent. Uh, tôi có thể bởi vì tôi mạnh mẽ. I can because I have a voice. I can because I'm not going to let others put me down.
finally, finally, don't forget to stop by the galley window before school and during passing time for first and third hour to warm up with a hot chocolate or coffee. That's all we have for you today. Once again, I'm Alex Dorsey. And I'm Michael Croft. Have a great rest of your day. We will see you back here on Friday.